Here's an update on what's happening at the city of Lakeville. Hanno Prague is back. Starting on the 4th of July and ending on the 15th, the city of Lakeville welcomes back its largest celebration. This year's events include cribbage tournaments, cruise night, ping pong ball drops, the grand parade, and much, much more. With 10 days of activities, there's fun for the whole family. For a full list of events and celebrations, visit panoprog.org. Hello, my name is Brian Carsonson, Fire Marshal for the City of Lakeville. Today I'd like to just discuss a few safety tips as it relates to fireworks. In 2002, fireworks became legal in the state of Minnesota. However, not all fireworks are part of that program. Any fireworks that explode or go aerial up in the air remain illegal in the state of Minnesota. The only fireworks that are legal are ones that shoot showers of sparks, uh, smoke bombs, sparklers, things of that nature where they don't actually leave the ground and they just shoot sparks off the ground. When using fireworks, please make sure there's an adult in the immediate area. These fireworks are extremely dangerous. They burn extremely hot. This is Brian Carsonson, Fire Marshal for the City of Lakeville. Please have a happy and safe 4th of July. With the crack of the bat and the bore of the crowd, Saints baseball is in full swing. Catch select St. Paul Saints baseball games on LG TV's public access. That's channel 187 on Charter Spectrum and Frontier Vantage. You'll be squealing in your seats as you watch the home team bring home the bacon. Saturday, July 14th at 1 p.m., the fourth annual Brew Battle Social takes place at the South Lawn of the Lakeville Area Art Center. While you sample over 50 beers from over 20 breweries, enjoy food, yard games, and live entertainment from Dave Hudson. Tickets are $25 in advance and 30 the day of the event. Pick up your tickets at any of the Lakeville liquor stores today. Hi, my name is Emily Ball. I'm the City of Lakeville Forester, and I'm here today to talk about Emerald Ash Borer. Emerald Ash Borer is an insect that is not native to our area that tunnels underneath the bark of ash trees and kills them. The City of Lakeville has thousands of ash trees. We know about 10,000 in the maintained areas of private property and about 3,000 on city properties. The early signs of detecting for emerald ash borer are usually seen through woodpecker activity. Woodpeckers like to feed on the larval stage of the insect, which is under the bark. During the growing season, you can also tell if your tree is infested by uh, a general thinning of the canopy. Emerald ash borer can be controlled through an injection of a pesticide. Uh, the injection is performed at the base of the tree, allowing the tree to pull the product up into the growing areas, killing any insects that feed on it. For more information about emerald ash borer and the injection program, visit the City of Lakeville website and type emerald ash borer in the search bar. A friendly reminder that City Hall will be closed on the 4th of July and reopen at 8 a.m. on the 5th. If you would like any more information about these or other city-related items, visit the city's website at lakevillemn.gov or call 952-985-4400. Thanks for watching, and now you're caught up on what's happening here at the City of Lakeville.